Alright guys, welcome back to Let's Play Rune Factory 2, A Fantasy Harvest Moon. In the last episode, we made some steady progress, and I really thought it would be about the same for this one, but a bit more has happened this time. Um, I'm going to be cutting away now, and I'll probably see you guys in like 10 to 15 minutes, my best guess. That might seem an exaggeration, it's not, I have a lot to show you, so give me just a minute while I show you everything I've done. So over here at the crafting station, we're going to take one platinum, another platinum, and a hammer piece. This is a level 31 recipe for the platinum bracelet. And now, we're going to take two silver, an insect skin, an amethyst, an arrowhead, and a scorpion pincer for the level 21 recipe the amulet. Alright, now we're going to take one iron, one proof of warrior, one panther claw, one bullhorn, one hardhorn, and one scorpion pincher, all together for the level 24 recipe, the lucky strike. Now we're going to take two silver, a cheap cloth, an arrowhead, and a plant stem for the level 24 recipe, the rosary. Now we're going to take one iron, four silver, and a sparkle string for the level 26 recipe pendant. Now we're going to take that pendant, a broken box, a little crystal, and a hammer piece for the level 54 recipe, the star pendant. We're taking two small fleece to make some small yarns. One medium fleece for one medium yarn, one large fleece for one large yarn. Now we're going to take our two small yarn balls, two regular, two small fleece, and a woolly fur ball all together to make the level 10 recipe, the hand knit hat. We can take a medium yarn ball, a large yarn ball, the small fleece and the medium fleece, as well as the woolly fur ball, all together to make the level 14 recipe. The hand knit scarf. We're going to take one ruby, one magic crystal, one broken box, one silk cloth, one bird wing, and one devil blood for the level 56 recipe. The proof of wisdom. And now, the art of attack recipe. We only have a 10% chance to make this. We're going to take a sparkle string, a silk cloth, a bird wing, a bullhorn, a rage fang, and a wolf fang. The 10% chance to make... The art of attack we did on the first try. Heck yeah! That is the highest level one. Alright, art of attack, a scroll detailing the secrets of attacking. Platinum bracelet. A platinum bracelet simply slipping onto your arm considerably raises both your strength and defense. Amulet. A charm said to protect the bearer from harm. Star pendant. A pendant shaped like a star glitters as brightly as any star in the night sky. Lucky strike. Just carrying this around increases your luck. Lucky hits will occur more often, boosting your damage. Rosary. An accessory used in prayer has a cross attached to it. Rage fang. A fairy hard tooth, strong enough to leave bite marks in iron. Proof of Wisdom, a badge only awarded those who have obtained complete and total knowledge. These eight items are items we have not shipped yet, seven of which we just made. This feels really good. Just to kind of compare, so the Art of Magic is just a better version of the Proof of Wisdom. I suppose the Proof of Wisdom at level 10 would give better defense, but it wouldn't give us as much magic attack. The Rosary is just a downgrade, as you might expect from that level of item. The Platinum Bracelet, while it doesn't actually boost the magic attack as much, it actually gives a little bit of attack, defense, and even magic defense. So that's not a bad thing. Heck, actually, if you got this to level 10, I could be at 91 defense with this. That's tempting. I won't do it because I just like having the art stuff on, but 
that's might actually be a better thing to do, and that's kind of sad that the Art of Magic isn't that good. <laughs> uh, Amulet? Eh. Yeah. As you might expect. And that puts us at 82% shipped. I'm not sure if that's accurate or not, if it's considered shipped. I guess we can check this. Yeah, I probably is considered. And I somehow missed these in my inventory, but the hand knit hat, a hat knitted from wool, warms both the head and the soul. The hand knit scarf, a scarf knitted from wool, warms both the neck and the soul. And I hadn't shipped this yet. The Happy Ring. A ring that brings good fortune, raising all stats, placing this on your finger will erase all your worries. Comparing it, uh, I mean, yeah, it's nowhere near as good. But that's a good boost to my attack and defense and whatnot. Oh, well. It's not what I want to do. Alright. Now that, yeah, it is at 86%. Okay, that is accurate then. Nice, nice. Now here at the chem station, we are going to take one of each of these flowers. To make mixed herbs. Now over here in the pot, we're going to take one pink turnip, one carrot, one flower, and one mixed herb for the level 26 recipe. Udon. Over here at the frying pan, we're going to take one onion, one egg, one shrimp, and one oil. For the level 43 recipe, tempura. Now over here at the chem station, we're going to take one yellow grass and one orange for the level 19 recipe, sour drop. And now here at the pot, we're going to take our udon, our tempura, a sour drop that we just made for the level 38 recipe, tempura udon. Now here at the frying pan, we're going to take one flour, one cabbage, one onion, one carrot, and one oil for the level 35 recipe. Fried Udon. Now here at the steamer, we're going to take one honey, one flour, and a cheese of any size. Depending on which one you use, you will have a different level recipe, either 15, 16, or 17. We make the cheese bread. Skill level increased. I was not expecting that. That's awesome. Alright. Cooking level 77. Nice. Now here at the frying pan, we're going to take a glitter snapper for the level 66 recipe. The fried glitter snapper. Fried Glitter Snapper. Glitter Snapper, salted, then fried. The fresher the fish, the tastier it will be when it's cooked. Cheese Bread. Steamed bread that has been baked with cheese. Its soft texture and gentle fragrance are exemplary. Fried Udon. The first person to fry Udon is said to have done so on a whim. Now it is widely loved. And Tempura Udon. Udon with tempura on top. The debate to either keep the tempura crisp or let it soak rages even today. And that puts cooking at 86 as well. Nice, nice, nice. We're gonna make one more small yarn ball. We're gonna make a small mayo. And a large mayo. One of our medium milks needs to be turned into a medium cheese. And a medium egg needs to be turned into a medium, medium mayo. We actually also need a large cheese. Alright, small mayonnaise, made from processing eggs, has a variety of uses on many types of food, from vegetables to fish. Medium mayonnaise, made from processing eggs, has a variety of uses on many types of food, from vegetables to fish. And large mayonnaise, made from processing eggs, has a variety of uses on many types of foods, from vegetables to fish. Medium milk, milk taken from a buffamu, high in calcium and other important nutrients. Medium cheese, made from processing milk, has a distinctive flavor, can be eaten as is, or used on, or in, many dishes. Large cheese, made from processing milk, has a distinctive flavor, can be eaten as is, or used on, or in, many dishes. And finally, the small yarn ball. A small bar, a small ball of yarn, can be made using the yarn maker.
All right. But it's at 89% for cooking. And 98% for others. We are extremely close. Now over here at the blender, we're actually going to take one pink melon and one strawberry. For the level 21 recipe, pray little love. Now down here at the chem station, we have a 10% chance of this, so it's not very high. But we'll give it a shot. Coming up aces today, Cupid's Kiss. Skill level increased. Now we're going to take one water crystal, one fairy, uh, fish fossil, one vine, one earth crystal, and one fairy powder. For the 28% chance at... Dang. Green of fire. Okay, we're going to take one fire crystal, one pink cat, one root, one strawberry, and one hot hot fruit. For a 28% chance at... The heart drink. Skill level increased. We're going to take one magic powder, one magic crystal, an eggplant, a cucumber, and a bluegrass for an 82% chance at making the mental supplement. And now we're going to take a devil blood, a strong vine, and an earth crystal for an 82% chance at making the formula C. Alright, we're about halfway through level 44 now. Okay. We have a 1% chance of making this, so one spinach, one root, one devil blood, one devil horn, and one proof of warrior all come together to make. That's to be expected. Skill level increased. I kept going until I got a skill increase, that way I could actually have a better chance of this. Okay, we now have a 10% chance. Not amazing or anything, but we have odds. Protein boost. That put us all the way past the Y in pharmacy. Cool. Cool, cool, cool. Alright. Protein boost. A health supplement created by a special process. Increases physical strength. Green fire. Raises the quality of crops. Can only be used once per harvest and must be used while still seeds. Cupid's kiss. A love potion created by scientists with a little too much time. It'll be love at first sip. Heart drink. A health supplement created by a special process. Increases HP. Formula C. Fertilizer. Speeds the growth of crops by three days. You'll see the difference one day after use. And mental supplement. A health supplement created by special process. Increases in intelligence. With this, I will be shipping the ones that I have already shipped, including the Green of Fire and the Formula C, because, you know, may as well at this point. Okay. And that puts us at 83% of all medicine made. Nice, nice, nice. For now, I'm going to grind out the ingredients for the protein boost. And I'm going to keep making that for the next couple days. Get up and level. That way I can start making more medicine. And now we are back on the 25th. Um, it is festival day, though not a normal festival technically. This is actually one of the ones that replaced a festival. Previously, I believe it was the fishing contest. And now it is the cooking contest. Though, it's a bit odd, I'll explain in a moment. So, before we actually get anything, let's talk to everyone. It's the big cook-off today! How are your skills in the kitchen? If you're not competent, then why not take part? If you're competent, why not take part? Whatever you said. Good morning! Morning, Arya! Today's the big cook-off! I can't wait to see what you cook up! It's nice to see that you've got a suntan for playing outside so much, Arya. Today's the big cook-off. Do you like to cook, Arya? Or perhaps you prefer, prefer just eat the results? A little bit of column A, a little bit of... No, it's just not actually column A. Uh, food sucks in this game. <laughs> the big cook-offs today! Arya, are you any good at cooking? Today's the big cook-off! You, you ever cook, Arya? A lot, actually. Today's the big cook-off! I must say I'm quite the cook, too. Yeah, I don't doubt that. We're gonna cook in the competition. How about you, Arya? Good luck, Arya. You too, Sarah. The fountain looks so cool and refreshing. If I knew no one would see me, I'd strip off and jump right in there. I understand these things. You must be planning on joining the big cook-off, right, Arya? Today's the big cook-off. You've been helping out your mother in the kitchen, Arya. 
Today is the big cook-off. I wonder if there will be lots of yummy food to eat. It's the big cook-off today. Can you cook, Arya? Yes, yes, I can. Today is the big cook-off. The food where I'm from has its own special character. You should try it sometime. Today is the big cook-off. I bet you're a pretty good chef, Arya. Today is the big cook-off. I guess that doesn't sound like too terrible of a contest. Morning. Morning. Today is the big cook-off. Are you going to enter, Arya? Yes, yes, I am. Kind of. That's the big cook-off today. There are lots of delicious things you can cook, even at your age, Arya. You may even win. As the organizer, my father is really particular about flavor, so unless you're really sure of yourself, it's pretty hard to win it. Today is the big cook-off, Arya! I'm more of a pro at eating myself! Today's the big cook-off. Start off eating like a hog when you're a kid, and you'll regret it when you're older. Oh, the big cook-off is today, Arya. Do you like to cook? I'm no good at cooking. At least she isn't good at it either. I wonder who she takes after. Today is the big cook-off. My dad is always so excited about today, given that he spends the entire year training for it. Today's the big cook-off. I hope they make some nice, healthy food. It's the big cook-off today. I can't wait to see what dishes they serve up. So today's the big cook-off. Are you gonna enter, Arya? Oh, Arya, we've been kidding, competing in this year's big cook-off. It's a chance to show off the fruits of your hard work. And if you win that special someone's opinion of you, no doubt go up. What's more, the winner will receive a fabulous prize. So how about it all? Also, if you haven't built a workshop or don't own an oven, you won't be able to compete. I'm in. That's what I'm talking about, Arya. And now for the rules. For the big cook-off, you'll be making a dish of my choosing. This year's dish will be... Mm, to seafood pizza. After you finish pre preparing your seafood pizza, please bring it to me. Your seafood pizza will be counted as your submission. The person who makes the most delicious seafood pizza will, be the, will win the grand prize. Do you need to hear the rules one more time? Ah, uh, no, we're good. Okay, let's get started. Everybody ready? Okay, big cook-off start! Okay, so a thing about the seafood pizza. I showed off the recipe for this a few episodes ago. I don't remember which episode. It might have been last episode, not very positive. Um, it requires a few things, the biggest being a squid, which I do not have and is not available at all during the summer or in any of the dungeons. You cannot obtain this if you did not already know that you needed seafood pizza. There is a way around this, kind of. It's a bit cheating. Now, if you do not have a seafood pizza, and you don't have the ability to make a seafood pizza, maybe you don't even have an oven. I don't know why you wouldn't have an oven by this point, but you could not. You can buy a seafood pizza from UA. If you buy a seafood pizza, it will count. But, there's a caveat to this. It's worth showing this, so I'm doing it. Hey, Herman. What a shame, Arya. The grand prize goes to Serena and Sarah. Congratulations, you two. Honorable mention goes to Arya. The partition uh, participation prize goes to Leanne. For the honorable mention prize, I present you with a first sleeping bag. Now, the reason for this is because you can never win. You will always get that honorable mention. You will never be able to get whatever the grand prize is. I... I've never actually won this one, because I think preparing that and taking up the inventory space for an entire season, essentially, is annoying. <laughs> it doesn't matter that much to me. But, here's everyone's reaction. I did it, I won! I won! Arya, you should try some of my food! Good morning! Good morning! Don't worry! Good morning! Your food looks so good, Arya! I didn't make it! That was too bad about the contest. Good morning, Arya. You're amazing, Arya. Your dish looks so good. Good morning. Morning. Wow, I didn't think you could pull it off. That's because I didn't. <laughs> morning. Morning. Wow, you can cook. I'm quite impressed. I didn't cook that. I know I bought this from you yesterday, but what do you have to say about it? You did it. You should be proud. Not everyone can be a good cook. You say as you wink at me, obviously knowing that I cheated. Oh, you didn't cook? You don't cook much, do you? I don't want to hear that from you, of all people. You look well in this morning, human. I didn't know you were good at cooking. I'm very good, but also, you know. Good morning. Morning, Arya. You look like you'd be good at cooking. Alright. I knew that Dad would... Do you like this town? Practice makes perfect, and that goes for cooking, too. Just keep at it. Good morning. Good morning. 
You shouldn't dwell too much on life's defeats. I'll share one of my secret recipes with you sometime. Morning. Impressive skills. Maybe I should get Roy to start cooking too. Don't want to burn down the house, but yes, everyone should know how to cook. Morning. Oh yeah, you still need some training if you want to call yourself the greatest gourmet in Alvarna. I don't want to call myself that, but I appreciate it. Morning, Arya! Bah, you did it, Arya! I didn't know you had it in you! Morning. Morning, Arya. Heck, you don't need to know how to cook. Just eat stuff raw. No, I don't think I will. Good morning. Well, the most important thing in cooking isn't taste, it's nutrition. That's the truth, especially for growing children. That is not true. If you want people to actually, you know, eat their food and grow strong, make it taste good. It's not hard to make it healthy and taste good. You just need to actually put in the effort and stop having that mindset. Morning. Good morning, Arya. Cooking is mostly effort and creativity. Work your hard so you can win next year. Wow, Arya, you're amazing. That looked really delicious. Morning. Good morning, Arya. You can really cook, Arya. I was impressed. Good morning. It looks like you've got a real aptitude for cooking, Arya. Morning, Arya! Some impressive cookery there, Arya! You've got an instinct for it! Keep up the good work! Morning! Morning! I'm sorry to hear you lost, Arya. I love your cooking. Congratulations, your most honorable of mentions! There we go, that was the last person, I'm pretty sure. Alright, so that was that entire festival. This one is a frustrating one. Because it is just, oh hey, I see you want to like, have a good time, but we're going to throw something at you that you can't possibly know about. It reminds me of the adventure contest from the first Rune Factory, or I think it was the adventure one. The one where you had to find a stone that you couldn't possibly make it there in time to be able to get first place, so who managed to get there in first place? There has to be a winner of every contest, so I don't know. You either use time manipulation or you prepare it for the next year. So, it's the same kind of thing. You either cheat in this way and get honorable mention, or you have saved up a squid for an entire month. I, I don't like it. <laughs> Alright, let's go into the next day. I'll see you in just a moment. Alright, and with that, we're on to a normal day. And hopefully, let me check... I got eight new cows, and they are all producing, so give me just a second. Now, over here in the kitchen, I actually need to make a few things. So, we actually need to make a small yogurt, a medium yogurt, and a large yogurt. And now, here at the chem station, we're going to be trying to make the level 56 recipe, the vital gummy. So we're going to take one giant's glove, one large milk, one tortoise shell, one uh, giant's fingernail, and one emery flower with 19% chance. Dang it. Vital gummy, there we go. Skill of increased, perfect. Another one. Vital gummy. And that puts us at almost 49, perfect. There we go. Skill of increased. And it puts us halfway to level 40. No, oh, halfway to level 50. Alright. Vital Gummy. A health supplement created by special process increases vitality. Medium yogurt. Made from processing milk settles and soothes the workings of the stomach. Small yogurt. Made from processing milk settles and soothes the workings of the stomach. A large yogurt. Made from processing milk settles and soothes the settles and smooths the workings of the stomach. And finally, a medium egg. A medium-sized egg taken from a cluckadoodle, encased in a fragile white shell. Alright, with that, we are at 91% of all cooking done. 87% of all medicine made. We are extremely close to being done. Alright, we actually need to make three more of these. So let's do it. Here we go, number one. Number two. Skill increased. And one more for good measure. There we go. That puts us over halfway to 51. Perfect. Now, vital gummies are a nice little tool. 
If you look at my stats right now, I have 80 defense. And we are now at 81. They permanently increase your vitality. And now, we are 85 defense, just naturally. Heck yeah. Alright, let's see if we can get this item. One emery flower. Gotta skill up during this. I'm already 87 in communication. Alright, so once again, we need to make one of these. So let's do it. Vital Gummy. Skill up increased. <clears throat> the reason I'm pushing this so hard is that I actually need two more levels. If I get up to level 53, I technically have a chance, I think? It might be 54. I think I might need three more levels. Um, I essentially need a possibility to make the next item. Because I can get the next item's ingredients actually kind of easier, in a way. And more importantly, it's better XP. But I'm fairly close. Om nom nom. Got the fingernail I needed immediately, so I need one more real quick. And I got it. Cool. <laughs> Vital gummy. Alright. So I'm probably gonna have to make a, like a dozen or two more of these to finish. Which means that obviously I'm not gonna be continuing this here. So, in the meantime... Let's work on a quest for a minute. A request from Natalie. I had something to give to you, but I lost it. Can you find it for me? Hey, Natalie. You're over on the right now. I don't know how I forgot that. How are you? I was planning to give you a missing page, too, but it looks like I lost it. I think it's at the school's library. Could you go take a look? Okay. If you find it, it's yours. Give it to Man at the school, and she'll fix one of your magic books for you. Uh, is it here? Let's play Sugar. Oh, no. Nope. Nope. Another time. This must be what Natalie was talking about. You got missing page two. I should give this to Mana so she can repair my magic book. Okay. Missing page two for cure. Can't be used until first page has been restored. Finally. Makes sense that Natalie would have that. I'm going to repair a magic book for you. That shouldn't be a problem. However, you need to bring me both a magic book and blah blah blah. La 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 la. You got the cure magic book. Alright. Cure. Healing magic. Restores HP. Has been restored to its maximum power. It heals 300 instead of 150 now. That's a pretty good boost. Heck yeah. Alright, let's see... What else should we work for? Let's deliver some cold medicine to Yue. From Dorothy. I'd appreciate if you delivered some cold medicine to Yue. Helping out all the doctors today. You're not who I was trying to talk to. Cut you. I saw the bulletin board. Anything I can help you with? Ah, uh, that's why you're here. Great. If it's not too much trouble, I want you to take this to Yue. You received the cold medicine. I was talking with her earlier, and it seemed like she was coming down with a cold, so please get this, get it to her quickly. Okay, no problem. Thank you for your help. Ah, is that the cold medicine I asked Dorothy for? You brought it for me. Yeah, she asked me to give it to you. Oh, great, thanks a lot. Thank Dorothy for me too, would you? Yeah, no problem. You do a fifth gold medicine to Yue? Thank you, and well done. Here's your payment. You got the back scratcher. Back scratcher? You're a great kid, Arya. Alright, uh, technically you get this pretty early on. 20 power is not bad for a beginning weapon. It's not amazing or anything, but I think this can be upgraded into something else, so. Not bad. 
Well, I'm thinking about it. I hadn't eaten this yet. So, um a num num. Alright, let's do one more for the day. Yeah, let's do this. A request from Gordon. My daughter's been having trouble lately! Help me out a little! Hi, Arya! I've got a favor to ask you! Could you get my water crystal back from Cammy? It seems she's really taking a liking to it, and she hasn't given it back to me yet. The problem is, I won't... I can't make any of my jewelry without it. She just won't listen to me, though. Huh. But it wouldn't be right for me to just go and steal it back. Since you're both children, I was hoping she'd listen to you. Thanks a lot, Arya. Hey, Arya, something up? Actually, Gordon asked me to do him a favor. He said he wants you to give him back his water crystal. I'll take it and bring it to him. Huh? No way, I really like it. Hey, Cammy, I think he really needs it back. Really? Yeah, he said he hasn't been able to make any accessories since you took it. He asked me to talk to you about it. He can't just take it from you, so he thought I might be able to convince you. I didn't know he couldn't make any accessories without it. Okay, I'll give it back. Here you go. Receive the water crystal. Thanks. See you later, Cammy. Bye. Oh, you did you get back from Cammy? I knew she listened to another child. You've been big help. Here, take this as my thanks. You got 600G. I've got something else for you, too. It should help you with your studies. And a missing page, too. Thanks, Aria. Okay. Missing page, too. The final page of Sonic Wind Magic Book. It can't be used until the first page has been restored. Sonic Wind! Yeah, I already missed my chance today. Oh well. Alright, I've been considering how to handle this, and I think what I'm going to do is I'm actually going to skip a bit. We're going to meet you back at the first day of fall for the Adventure Contest. Not only will we be able to handle the Adventure Contest, but at that point I'll be able to catch most of the rest of the fish I'm missing? There might be some during the winter, I'm not positive, but uh, I'll figure that out between. So I'll see you all in just a moment for you, and probably like a day or something for me. Bye bye Here at the crafting station, we're going to take one iron, one panther claw, one strong string, one insect skin, one giant's glove, and one speckled skin for the level 12 recipe. The leather belt. Now we're going to take that leather belt, some glue, a devil horn, a bowl horn, a hammer piece, and a silk cloth for the level 69 recipe. That's the champion belt. So we're going to take one little crystal, one bowl horn, one magic crystal, one iron, one magic powder, and one, and one fairy dust to make the level 49 recipe, the ring shield. Alright, the ring shield, a magical enhanced ring that offers the same level of defense as a shield. Feather boots, super light boots, so light you feel as though you're walking on air, enables the backstep ability. And the champion belt, a belt awarded alongside the ch title of champion. With this around your waist, you'll intimidate everyone. Now, the feather boots, I don't technically have this. I haven't made it, or maybe I have... I feel like I did, or maybe I purchased it and then used that to make the night boots. I'm not positive. But it's something you can purchase. It's super easy to do. So I'm actually taking the easy way out here and just buying it rather than gathering up the materials. Why does the Art of Defense give less than the Champion Belt? Oh, I guess it doesn't. I guess it gives you a huge body up. All right. All right, cool. I was about to say, like, really? All right, cool. All right. And with that, we are at 89% of all accessories. Not bad, not bad. All right, I meant to ship this a while ago, but for some reason it's just been hanging out in my inventory. Feathered cap, a hat with a feather in it. Protects the head, makes your movements elegant, and raises intelligence. Out of curiosity, it would actually up my defense by 16, but it would lower my magic attack by 21 and my magic defense by 5, so I'm good. But, you know. Now I'm up to 90%. Cool. I finally broke that barrier. The only thing I'm at... Okay, so I'm at 87 and 89. Soon. 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 
and we are back for the first day of fall for the adventure contest. Away! <laughs> Morning. Morning, Arya. Morning, Dad. Today's the adventure contest. Are you going to enter? Yes, I am, but... I have learned that you don't just give boiled eggs. Thanks a lot, Arya. I'm proud of you. I'm glad I could help. I'm going to give this to you in return. I say as you just give me a boiled egg. I have gotten both an ice cream and a chocolate cookie from him. In addition to the boiled eggs. I've just been trying... I've just been giving him random herbs I've been finding, and it seems to work. So, boiled eggs, chocolate cookie, ice cream. Those are the three items I know he can give. Today's the day of the adventure contest! If you're gonna take part, make sure you don't do anything too dangerous, okay? Today's the adventure contest. Are you gonna enter it, Arya? I love holidays. I want to relax and read a book. Are you gonna be in the competition, Arya? Good luck, Arya. Good morning. Good morning. I that your dad came back. The leaves scattered around the school would be perfect for wrapping potatoes for baking. You are always going on adventures, aren't you, Arya? If you take part in the adventure contest, Arya, then no one will stand a chance. Today's the adventure contest. Just leave me out of it. Sounds too dangerous for me. Today's the adventure contest. Are you going to try your luck, Arya? What does Autumn remind you of, Arya? Whenever I come here, Roy and Cammy always bug me to play with them. It's the adventure contest today. A real test of your mettle. The well, weather really varies in the fall. It's a real pain sometimes. Today's the adventure contest, but if you participate, be sure to take care of yourself. Adventuring can be pretty dangerous, you know. Anything interesting happening? There's the adventure contest today. I like to think I'm pretty good at that sort of thing. Hey, Aya, wanna go collect leaves with me? An adventure contest, just leave the adventure stuff to me. I must say, today's turned out to be quite a fun day. Today's the adventure contest. I feel like it might be a little, still a little dangerous for you though, Aria. What do you want, little human? Today's the adventure contest. Children had best stay away. Morning. Morning, Aria. Today's the adventure contest. You're still a kid, so I bet must so I bet it must sound like fun to you. A little bit. Actually, do you have another dialogue? Not very many people pass through here. It's nice and quiet. We're not talking about the adventure contest yet, but much obliged. Isn't this a pineapple juice? Are you giving this to me? Thank you. I'm trying to raise his affection with me. I need him to be higher. I want everyone to be at least five within the next few weeks, so... Him being down at two is not okay with me. The same for Ray. Hey, thanks. I love these. And Alicia. Oh, I'm so happy. I love it. Thank you. Any of those people get up from three? Room two? Okay. Ray is at three now. Cool, cool. I guess this is as good a time as any to start doing this. I'm actually going to give friendly syrups to everyone today. Please take this. Oh, what's this? You've been a good friend to Leonel too, haven't you? Thank you! Now, I don't know if it works for more than one gift today, but I can try. You want me to drink this? Okay, but... Oh, how it tastes delicious. Thank you. It does actually work. Nice. It works in addition to the daily gift. Here, you can have this. What is it? When I see you working so hard, Arya, it makes me want to do the same. Leanne, try drinking this. Can I drink this, Arya? It looks really good, I must say. I'll give it a try, then. Mm. Well, was it good? Thank you. Yes, it was delicious. Thank you, Arya. You're giving this to me? I'll try it out. I want half. Delicious, thanks. I want more. So I think they share that. Is this for me? Thanks. I can't wait to drink it. Here, drink this. What is it? I just need to drink it. Thanks for playing with me, Arya. Here, try this. What is it? Should I drink it? Well, I guess talking with you isn't that bad. Oh, thank you. On that note, tasty indeed. this is delicious. Thank you. You freaking Muppet not even knowing my name. <laughs> Autumn certainly is the time for gathering swords. It's the adventure contest today. If you're going to take part, you'd better come with, up with the best gear you can. You better come up with the best gear you can for my store first. Except you're not running a store today. This is for you. Oh, what is it? 
Let me have a try, then. Thank you for being such a good friend to Roy. As I'm sure you can see, the, this harbor is very small. A large number of ships can't put in here at the same time. Oh, the adventure contest today. There will probably be injuries, so I bet Ray is worried sick. Thank you. Thank you, Ari. I'm thrilled. I'll just go right ahead and drink it now. Mmm, this tastes great. Have a drink of this. What's this? Is it okay to drink it? <laughs> You're a funny character, are you? Thanks. Here, drink this. What is it? Does it taste good? <laughs> I feel really strange. Um, thank you for everything you do for me, Arya. I'm really grateful. This is for you. Oh, is this for me? Be nice to Orwind, okay, Arya? Today is the adventure contest! I'm gonna stay here and pray for everyone's safety! Here, this is for you. You have something for me? Which is it? Wahaha! <laughs> Thank you for being such good friends with Cammy. Today is the adventure contest. Even kids can participate, so don't miss it. Is this to drink? Alright then. I got this feeling you and me are gonna be good friends. There's an adventure contest today. There's always a lot of injuries. I worry about I'm worried about Ray. Oh, this color looks like it should work. I'll take it. It's delicious. They say good medicine tastes bitter, but this tastes wonderful. So today's the adventure contest. I think you should sit this one out, Arya. It's too dangerous. Do you ever go to play in the park? Is this for me? Thanks, I'll drink it right now. Thanks, it was great. I can't help feeling that this town is very wide. It's all in a straight line. Don't you think so too, Arya? The adventure contest is, is today. Even children are allowed to enter. Should I drink this? Hmm, this is good, thanks. Today's the adventure contest, so it looks like kids can participate too, but... You're giving this to me, Arya? Thank you. It's the adventure contest day. This one always causes a lot of injuries. I hope people don't get too carried away is all. Here, you can have this. Wow, thanks. You're a good kid, Arya. You always cheer me up. And I believe I am three friendly syrups short. So another time I'll have to show off those three. I did not give one to Julia. I did not give one to Barrett, and I did not give one to Jake. I don't think I've missed anyone else, but if so, I'll figure that out. But not for now. It's the adventure contest today, I, but I think I'll pass. After all, adventuring and stuff can get pretty dangerous. Oh, Arya, will you be participating in the adventure contest? For the adventure contest, we'll be measuring the time it takes for you to find a specific item in a wild area. You'll be competing to find the item in the shortest possible time. It's a chance to show off your skills as an amazing adventurer. And if you win, that special someone's opinion of you will no doubt go up. What's more, the winner will receive a fabulous prize. So how about it? I'm in. That's what I'm talking about, Arya. And now for the rules. When I say start, the timer immediately starts running. So please head to the Potova Mountains as quickly as possible. Once you reach the mountains, head to the eastern part of the cave and start checking in every nook and cranny for the platinum. You'll be timed for the moment the clock starts to the instant you find the platinum. Do you intend to hear the rules again? Let's go. Okay, so let's get started. Is everyone prepared? Okay, on your marks. Get set. Go! Okay, so the timer is frozen currently. Uh, is it here? Arya gets platinum for the adventure contest. I thought it was here. This is a very vague memory. <laughs> All right, and I'm good. Please head to the Pokemon Mountains as quickly as possible. Yeah, okay. Yep, I know. I'm aware. Oh, what an unbelievably fast time. To think that I live to see such unprecedented unpre speed. Congratulations, Arya. Allow me to grant you the title of Little Adventurer. For your efforts, Arya, hereby I present you with this protein boost. You got protein boost. Congratulations, Arya. I admit defeat this time. Alright. Protein boost. We literally made it, I think, earlier this episode. So, this is one way to get it, should you need it. I obviously don't need it, so, om and om and om. One more attack, permanently. Alright, so the lowest people are Alicia, Ray, Herman, Rosalind, and Leanne at three. Everyone else is at four, five, six, seven, eight, or even Lionel at nine. Good morning. 
Good morning, Arya. Wow, Arya, I can't say I'm surprised, though. Morning. Morning? Well done, Arya. I must admit, you've quite surprised me. Morning. Wow, you didn't do anything too dangerous, did you? Morning. Morning, Arya. Congrats, Arya. Just be careful you don't overdo it, though. Good morning. That was amazing, Arya. You're so small yet so powerful. Morning, Arya. That was quite a remarkable time, Arya. Well done. Morning. Morning. That's amazing, Arya. And to think you're still a kid. You look well in this morning, little human. Hey, that's not too bad for a human. Well, I beat your son, so... Morning. Morning. You must be proud of yourself. You did well. Morning! You did great, even though you're still just a kid. You must take after your father. Good morning, Arya. Really, and Arya, perfect. Please, can you give the other participants a chance next year? I don't think anyone will take part otherwise. <laughs> nice. Good morning. Good morning. Hello. Great job, Arya. Nice, Arya. You're amazing. Good morning, Arya. You're amazing, Arya. You're really good at that. Good morning. Good morning. So you won? That's great, but I don't really like you doing all those dangerous things. Good morning. Wow, you did well. Did my sword help you out? Not even a tiny bit, but it's fine. Good morning. morning, Arya. Congratulations, you won. You did such a great job. I'll give you a kiss on the cheek. Yuck. Well, uh, um... <laughs> eh, don't be a creep. Morning! Morning, Arya! Morning. morning, Dad! Congratulations, Arya! I had a feeling you'd win! Morning! Morning, Arya! Arya, you're good at adventuring, too. I guess you can be one of my buddies. Morning, Arya! That was great, Arya! We should go out exploring sometime! Morning, Arya! You did great! You did it, Arya! Morning! Morning, Arya! Not bad, Arya, not bad! Good morning! Good morning! Good morning. You won. Great job. Morning. Congratulations on winning. Good job. Good morning. Congratulations. Looks like looks like I underestimated you, Arya. And I think that's everyone I've spoken to now. So that is it for the festival. Normally I'd be like, oh, I'll meet you on this other day or in the episode or whatever, but not quite. So give me just a minute. I'll see you at the school. All right, 64%, so highly likely. Let's make these. I thought I had more gloves, but I apparently don't. Vital Gummy has been made. Yuck it. I need two more, so let's just go do it. Okay, that's one. There we go, that's two. Oh, it's lunchtime. The ultimate curry. Yeah, that thing I still can't make, so... If you're just trying to complete your ship list, honestly, just get the ultimate curry from that. It's not really worth making on your own. <laughs> Realistically, I've gotten, like, six of them, I think, just by coming in here. Just get them through that. Vital Gummy? Vital Gummy. Not a skill level. Well, how much do I need? I need to make literally anything at this point. Alright, I'm going to use two red grass to make. Heavy spice. Skill increased. That's what I wanted. And I'm going to use all these vital gummies. So I'm going to take these seven large milks and turn them into large cheese. I'm going to take these seven large milks and turn them into large yogurts. Do I have everything? I need four leaf clovers. I better have four leaf clovers or else I'm going to be slightly sad. That is so sad. Now over here at the forge, we're going to take our standard rod that we can buy from Tanya, one magic powder, one tortoise shell, one iron, one water crystal, and one arrowhead for the level 30 recipe, the ice staff. And now we're going to take that ice staff along with one milk of any size and one honey for the level 15, 17, or 19 recipe, depending on whether you used small, medium, or large milk, the ice cream. That is, once again, one of those things that you can get through other means. You can get it randomly. Um, I think it's a, a reward from a request, and also your dad can give it to you if you give him items every day. So, if you don't feel like forging up a ice staff for it, just do it that way. <laughs> Alright, so I was planning on doing some more grinding. I was planning on grinding out uh, another one of the recipes and opening up essentially endgame content for 
uh, chemistry. The issue with that is that I don't have four-leaf clovers, and I thought I did. I don't have any growing, and I also just don't have any in storage. Because of that, I'm going to end things here. Next time on Let's Play Rune Factory 2, A Fantasy Harvest Moon. We're going to open this up real quick just to see what the next festival is. Uh... I will meet you guys actually at the Harvest Festival. We've obviously seen both Ray and Max's birthdays before. We don't need to show that. So the Harvest Festival will be the next festival. I will probably meet you the day before that and go over crafting stuff. I will probably have whatever I need to craft more of the stuff and we will go through and do a bunch of requests that day and then follow it up with Harvest Festival. So I'll see you all next time and I hope you have a fantastic day. Goodbye!